Hello, Merry Christmas, Christmas Day 2017. Doing a little Bread of Life series. I'll put it off for a little bit here, a couple of days, so I can do it on Christmas Day. And it is so. I shall be like thy son. Is this the grace for which for me hath won? Which he for me hath won? And our verse today is uh, Romans 8 and 29. For it's uh, whom he did foreknow he also did predestinate to be conformed to the image of his son. We'll hop over here to uh, in the study Bible. Romans 8 and 29. And the verse is in black and the uh, notes are the red. For whom he, God, did foreknow, God's foreknowledge, he also did predestinate to be conformed to the image of his son. It is never the person that is predestined, but rather the plan that he, Jesus, might be the firstborn among many brethren. Doesn't mean that Jesus was born again as a sinner, as some teach, but rather that he is the father of, sal of the salvation plan having paid the price on the cross, which made it all possible. And uh, this is the day we celebrate his birth. And Easter is when we celebrate his resurrection. But uh, some people do believe that uh, everybody's predestined. And I don't believe that, and I don't believe the Bible teaches that. It uh, tells us about we have free will as man. We have, you know, we have free will. And uh, what it's saying here is that the uh, plan of salvation was predestined. And if you follow it, then you'll be conformed to be like Christ. And you're not predestined for hell or predestined for heaven. You're not hand-picked out like some teach. It's just that when you finally make the decision to become born again, then your destiny changes and you're headed for heaven and to be Christ-like. Well, I hope that made sense for you all, for somebody out there helped them. Like I say, I say this every time, I'm not a preacher, I'm not a Bible scholar. I'm just a guy sitting here reading a good book and... Uh, trying to share. Well, I hope you all had a very, very wonderful Christmas. And uh, just remember, it's not about the gifts that we give or receive. It's about the gift that God gave us, the ultimate gift. Friends, till next time, thank you for watching, and God bless every one of you.